and uh, and he should be and his behavior also sounds uh, one of the main characteristics. on a separate sheet of paper what are the words that come to us when we think about if we were a leader so we did not take this from a sustainable development point of view once we got down the words and we decided that we had to break the words up into various groups or different types of qualities so we had lots of ideas going about and we got inspired by the presentation where they had the themes like think like feel like that it. it's all up here and when it's all up here, we decided why not just put it all in the brain. So we put it all in the head and we made it look like a jigsaw puzzle to show how each of the qualities are linked to each other. So it doesn't matter if you're a person who's sympathetic or if you're a person who knows how to delegate, you're still linked to each other. So this is how group three came up with this idea of the poster. The two groups that you have that you didn't hear. No, I think most okay. of them are quite similar. Um, the process was yeah, the, okay. the process was different, so I thought I'd mention yeah. that okay. as opposed to the different words that we had come up with. All right, thank you very much. All right, good for Superman. An old man. The leader of our generation. Look at his body. <laughs> he is good communication skills. He communicates with people, and he is cooperative. Like the and he believes in teamwork and he is a champion, he is focused, he promotes the green energy, that's the building and this is the base of the building and look at the, this, this is the man and he is confident in his base so this good, being good leader we need confidence, this is the confidence that provides the good leadership and these are the, this is the quality of good leadership, he loves us, look at the ants, they are hard working and this is the plantation of trees and this is his vision, looking the green society and this is the present need of the greener planet, the sustainable man for the green, green planet. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Go to the concept of this, uh, this model first. You see the circle here is represent a person or a leader. And we think the leader is like the what Robert uh, presented yesterday. It's heart, head, heart and hand. Right? And you see the, the arrows here, it means that it can start from anywhere. Sometimes you have knowledge, and then you act, and then it goes to you. I think it's pretty much covered by the other group. Maybe some that uh, feel like self-awareness is more like within a person. And vision is most likely everyone, right? Agree. Open-minded, and they have to be lucky, and get oriented, and having cognitive, yep. and have to be have to have a very strong all the time. That's what we mean by the... But so I think we can just have a look around when we put it on the, on the wall. It indicates the glacier is advancing and, and, and the glacier goes to fossil. Most important is when you are talking or you know, referring, you have to the balance is positive, it's advanced. Okay, it makes more bigger and more bigger. Yeah? As simple as that, okay. And there is a place where it is equilibrium. The budget is with you. It's not adding, it's not they have done extensive research on biodiversity conservation, climate change related issues, largely in the Eastern Himalayas, but his work is not limited to Eastern Himalayas, so it is everywhere. Uh, and uh, uh, topic, again, I mean, he, he starts with biodiversity, but he hardly lifts any topic on cost. So that's his speciality. So let's welcome uh, Dr. Chetri, Dr. Nabil Chetri. Wood and other stuff. Uh, provisioning and regulating like climate regulation, cleaning and other things, the cultural aesthetic. So these things are changed because of this driver. So we need to understand this particular framework if we have to work for effective conservation of biological life. Yeah, yeah. 
Ne diyor? Al kamalya in the presence of ABC. It was not like, you know, we can see the haze pollution. We see like, uh, I mean like the number of days, uh, the, uh, we are seeing the mountains has reduced. But that was not... Can you explain about the Asian brown now? Asian brown. The uh, South Shift is uh, in the China, China, not in Pakistan. So Pakistan may be like, you can see the different patterns. So that was, I mentioning was for China. Uh, and may, uh, yeah, of course, like we also observed, like we did a lot on Pakistan flood and we could see like a clear, like what you have mentioned, like the shift is on the other side. Yes. Now, the, a long process of carbon buildup. That uh, um, one species of moth in London actually evolved, adapted, and changed their mimicry. Their because it, you know they actually were mimicking the tree bark, and with the as the slow progression of certain carbon continued, they were. Able if you look at only our own country, you see undernourished people. Not because they're living in the most vulnerable location. They need to be uh, informed in advance. They need to help for uh, moving from there. What is their food? Catches and livestock. They don't. They need the help in order to move. Uh, they, their lives are dependent on us. Therefore, we 